Hola a todos y bienvenidos a Chorri Aventuras de Lazcar. Continuamos con American Arcadia, donde... Trevor. Kovacs, si puedes escucharme, este lugar está lleno de drones. Tienes que hacer algo. Quiere hacer cosas. Oh. Vale. Vale, ¿qué se supone que voy a hacer con el dron este? Oh. Ah, vale, esto es para hackear. ¡Ja! <risas> es más de mustache. Fordan. <risas> Aún no. Vamos, gira, gira.
Pues parece que no hay más. Oh, oh, looks like the drones are on our side now. Cool. Pero no todos, solo algunos. Why is this door beeping so loud? Stop beeping, damn it! Hexagon, drone to core hall 40B. Drone to core hall 40B. Drone to 40B. What's going on? The drones are off. Eye on the target. Tenía que haber girado para el otro lado. A ver. Ah. Vale, ya tengo el dron correcto. Ahora tengo que hacer el pipi -pip cuando esté viniendo para acá. Breaking the low, breaking the low. This is amazing. <laughs> There's the subject. Hold it right there. D drop your guns. I'm warning you. These drones now do my bidding. So you bajando. Or, or, I won't be responsible for the harm these little killing machines might cause you. Subject 10392. You're giving me way too much trouble for a pathetic wimp. I still wonder how you managed to get the required rank to control and manipulate Arcadia's automated personnel. But it doesn't matter anymore. I'll escort you back to your cell. As soon as I have you rendered unconscious. Bajando. Kovacs, if you can hear me, please do something. Kovacs. Who is Kovacs? Ah! So that was Miss Solano's doing. Yes, but she obviously knew it wasn't that far to the ground. That's why she opened the hatch. Uh, yeah, yeah, of course, of course. I mean, I have had everything under control. What? He said, Kovacs, do something, and I did the first thing that came into my mind. Sapiti, 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 sap. Don't move! Don't move or I'll shoot you, I swear to God! I know when someone has what it takes to pull the trigger just by looking in their eyes. And you don't have the guts, 10 Oh, por Dios. Mi es Tevor. Damn it! Just leave me alone! En serio? En serio, le das... En <risa> serio, sí, le has tirado eso. Hexagon. Hexagon, do you copy? Damn it. Dale. Oh, vaya. Fallé.
Pero, dude. Hola. Seguro que va por el metal. There won't be a next time. I can guarantee you that. Me pregunto por dónde andará. habré adelantado llevo un rato que no le veo Me mosquea no verle. O sea que se había bugueado. No sé si te diría, vivía mejor si el bicho este persiguiéndome. through my jump I suddenly realized how rickety the ladder was but it was too late to do anything about it oh no no I fell about nine feet and I landed in a puddle of some sort of thick liquid it smelled awful but it helped cushion the blow you think you I'll get you again! You won't get out of Arcadia! You hear me? <laughs> I won't allow it! Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Keep barking, you idiot! Eso de que el otro le persiga continuamente, viéndose a él como el código con su ID, es muy los miserables. What do I do now? Where do I go? What on earth? Don't be a fool. And welcome to Arcadia. Or at least welcome to the land where the city of tomorrow is being built. 
The Arcadia project is moving forward spectacularly fast, and we hope to have it finished for summer of 1961. Let's take a quick view of some of the amazing perks that Arcadia has to offer. First of all, our suburbs. Modern housing with the latest technology Fall included. Out. Service droids, voice-operated devices, and everything a modern American family needs. And with our road system that will communicate easily with the downtown area, you won't have to worry about traffic anymore. Get to work either by monorail or an electric car. And what about leisure? If you want to enjoy a good movie, there is a spectacular drive-in theater with an immersive new system called Visiorama. But that's not all. We have a special surprise for our audience, and here is our good friend Arpad Kovacs to explain it to us. Hello, Mr. Walton. Hello, kids. I am here to tell you we are building a new TV studio right here in Arcadia. So from now on, I will be recording Architects of Tomorrow from my workshop right here. Isn't that amazing? So, Arcadia already has its first neighbor. What are you waiting for? Call and make your reservation so you can be one of the lucky ones to be selected. Ask for housing in Arcadia now and be welcome to... A wonderful tomorrow to live in. Arcadia? What? What is this? Angela? Hey! I, I, I'm here, do you hear me? Oh, God, finally! It's so good to hear your voice! Where am I? Is this the first prototype of Arcadia? Yeah, this was what Walton and Kovacs had in mind. But then Don and the board of directors took over, and they turned Elijah's dream into this American nightmare where being unpopular is punished with death. Muy fallout. I don't know where you got that info, but nobody has been killed in here. What, what are you talking about? Gus is not dead. Vivian showed him to me. But, but I saw him. I... Well, what exactly did you see? Besides Gus leaving with two security guards. I, I don't know. I don't know. Forget it. Okay, let's just focus on getting you out of here. I don't think there is a way out of here, Angela. I'm afraid I'm trapped in here. No, 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 listen to me. We have a new plan. Let's sit down, Trevor, please. Tenemos un nuevo plan. Vamos a lavarte el cerebro. Me. No, 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 not at all. Well, it sounds pretty similar to what Vivian wanted to do with me, with that realignment thing. I know, I know, but we know what we're doing. Trust me. No offense, Angela, but considering how things went last time, it's not easy for me to just blindly trust in your plans. And anyway, even if you magically reprogram me without leaving me brain damaged, I've already crossed the jingle area before, and it didn't work out. How am I going to get out of the dome anyway? Maybe I can help with that. Wait, who is this? Number six? Are you okay? Yes, Kovacs. I touched in a couple of minutes ago and heard your conversation. Sorry for the indiscretion, but I had to interrupt. My name is Number Six. I am the leader of Breakout, the activist group Kovacs works for. Okay. 
Okay, nice to meet you. Hey, I've told you there is no way to escape from Arcadia, right? Let me prove to you they're lying. Come with me. Next to the Arcadia Central Plaza, you'll see a painted sign on a billboard with six names. That is us, the Arcadia Six. If my memory is correct, we left a trash container below the water tower, covered by some bushes. Just climb the water tower. I need to show you something. Tío, que estoy, estoy cansado. Estoy cansado. Llevo corriendo, saltando, golpeándome. He tenido un accidente de tráfico a 150 km por hora. Dude. Yeah, there's an abandoned car there. It looks rusty now, though. No es dolores. Arcadia is a gilded cage, and we know it. Sid wanted to leave a farewell message. It is his trademark. No, es Sid. Quedan cuatro. Right there. See that underground tunnel? That goes straight to the exit. No dome, nothing. Just a few steps, and you'll be out of Arcadia. El túnel con los. But they have two of those jingle emitters on each side. That makes sense. They were not there when we got out. Ya, pero ¿por qué no pueden tapiar esa salida? Maybe some of our intel is wrong. Maybe they're not killing people in there. There is something you and I know for sure to be true. As long as you are inside Arcadia, you will always be a prisoner. <risa> Me ha emocionado tu dialéctica, <risa> pero he perdido pie. To have some time to think about it. So, take your time. Whenever you are ready. Walton Media Studios, Arquitectos del Tomorrow. Dentro, fuera, fuera. Dentro. Angela? You still there? Hey, Trevor. Yeah, I'm here. I think this is the Architects of Tomorrow TV set. Yeah. Last two Architects seasons were recorded in this studio inside Old Arcadia. But nothing was the same after Walton stuff. Not even Architects. Wait, that's... That's the piano Kovacs always played at the end of every episode. Oh really? It's still there? It was my favorite part. That's what got me into music. You mind if I... No, no, go ahead. Nobody can hear you here. Suena bien.
I still have to give it a name. Wait, you wrote this? It, it's yours? Yeah, it's mine. I didn't know you were so talented, Trevor. Have you ever thought of becoming a professional musician? No. I like to keep that to myself. You know, maybe my life wasn't good American Arcadia material, but it was quiet and peaceful. I know I'm not the most interesting guy on the planet, but I've never hurt anyone, and I don't deserve all the crap that I'm going through. I know, Trevor. And for what it's worth, I have to say that you may not be the most interesting guy on the planet, but you're a good person, and I like you. And I'm sure a quiet and peaceful life is waiting for you out there. Maybe you'll have to chuck that grandpa get up and throw on something a little bit more up to date, but other than that, you'll be fine. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's do this. We will be extremely careful, I swear it. Yeah, 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 sure. Just do it before I change my mind. At that moment, I realized how fond I had grown <laughs> of that old fuddy-duddy mustache-wearing average show. I wasn't doing this because of the Walton Media breakout war anymore. I just wanted to get my friend out of that city once and for all. That was really moving, Kovacs. Thank you. It was critical to convince such a valuable asset like Trevor to... Uh, I haven't said anything to convince him. I just said what I feel. And please, don't call him an asset. Trevor's not an asset, okay? I understand. I apologize. It's all right. What do we do now? You must get inside the realignment area and find any relevant information that allows us to comprehend how the jingle works. Muy bien. Pues ahora que tenemos el control de Kovacs vamos a dejarlo aquí por hoy esto ha sido la charla de ventanas de Blackwood y oh mierda espero ah no había una salida por aquí sí pensaba que tenía que salir otra vez por láser pero no así que nada hasta la próxima en la charla de ventanas de Blackwood adiós